I don't want to brag, but in my village, we were considered royalty. We were so rich that we actually owned our goat. Oh yeah, and we had a can opener too. So, let me tell you something about myself. I love talking about myself. When I was 10 years old, I loved putting on makeup and mink coats. Yes, madam. Because you see, my father was a mink farmer. Then one day, when I was wearing a mink to school, a boy said, you make us all feel like a go-doo-doo. So I said, no, no, you are not a go-doo-doo. You're just a puddle of goat pee. <coughs> so he hit me. Sorry, madam. When I came to the next day, I went and told this to my grandmother in her castle above our village. Yes, madam. That's when she told me that I was actually a Polish royalty. Well, duh! <coughs> But my family is all gone now. Sorry, madam. My parents died five years ago in a mink attack. Then my grandmother passed away. So. I'm all alone now, except for my sorry goat. I have came to Los Angeles to search for my royal family. So hold your goats, America, because I'm making a video journal of my trip. That way, all of you can help me find my family, right? <coughs> you are helping, okay? Today, let me show how I occupied my new apartment. This is a very cozy. You did say it's okay for me to have a goat here, right? As I say, pets are okay. Just give me first month's rent and then move in. Come on, I haven't got all day. Now sign this. That's it, move in now, bye! <laughs> Next day, we went to Beverly Hills, or as our cabbie called it, Celebrity Snobville. So, let me tell you about it. You are listening, okay? We decided to go to Rodeo Drive. Show me the cows. I can't drive. <coughs> But that's where all the royalty shops, and I love to shop. I'm royalty. <coughs> God damn it. What else do you think I do? Show them the first picture. Yes, madam. You sorry goat? You're supposed to sniff relatives, not eat the landscape. Sorry, madam. Then you got us lost. Sorry, madam. Whatever. We finally got there. And guess what? No parade, no red carpet, and no blintzes. Reckon, shakum, reckon, shakum. Don't you peasants recognize royalty when you see it? It seemed like a little shit of celebrity named Justin Bieber stole our show. Sorry, madam. What is Bieber? <coughs> It sounds like something my dad used to shoot in the woods. Yes, madam. Lord Harry and I came to Los Angeles a few days ago. And what happened? Wasn't I on a rodeo drive or Muppet show? We've met some weird people here, including my landlord Henry. And since we changed the place to look the way I wanted to look, we put grandma on a wall, so she always be with me. Anna, honey, thank you for following my dying wish. Grandmother, you are in my heart every day. I will do anything to find our royal relatives. I know you do, honey, and I'm going to be watching you. And I'm going to be watching you, watching me, watching you. What did I just say? Anyhow, today I learned that even though it is a big country, it doesn't matter who you are or what you are. It's for everybody. Including my stupid goat, 
Yes, madam. So I guess since they're no different than the people back home, then the world is just a one big village. <laughs> That's it, Harry. No more borscht for you. Ever. Thank you.